Hey guys, welcome to another video. Today is my friend Avi's 39th birthday. As such, he has requested I do this video. This is not a video I am open to doing. I'm gonna answer a question that has been at the center of every religion since the dawn of time. A question that has boggled the mind of theologists, philosophers, and politicians for centuries. This video may bring about the end of the world. We may see the start of World War III today. We may even see a nuclear holocaust, all because of one question. But he was insistent. So for him on his birthday, I will do this. We're gonna answer that question. Can you shave with canola oil? Stay tuned, because I'm That's right, I am Dave Shaves, and today we are gonna answer the age-old question, can you shave with canola oil? So, as I mentioned, it is my friend Avi's birthday. Happy birthday, off. Uh, we were discussing it last night. He wasn't really that insistent on this video, but I asked him what he wanted to do, and he came up with a couple ideas and uh, asked me if I would dry shave. I think he was kidding. Uh, asked me if I would dry shave with the, uh, Vikings Blade Chieftain Razor and the Astra Green. Uh, he did ask me to shave with those. He asked me to dry shave, as I mentioned, and I told him I'm not up for that. I think it would kill my skin. So uh, I went ahead and compromised and said I would do shaving with uh, canola oil. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to shave with canola oil today. And then, as I mentioned, we're going to be using the Vikings Blade Chieftain Razor. We're gonna be loading that up today with Astra Superior Platinum, Astra Green. Pop it right on there. And then we're gonna be finishing up actually with just plain old rubbing alcohol. That was his idea as well. So that's what we're gonna to do today. We're gonna to see how well it works. I thought this was a good way to go ahead and finally do something other than just coconut oil. People have been curious about vegetable oil, so I thought, why not? I think it would work great as a pre-shave. I don't know how well it's gonna work as an actual shaving cream, but we will find out. Um, and that's really it. So nothing really super exciting about this. Uh, it is a question that I've asked, and people have said you can shave with different oils and canola oil will slick in the face, so we're gonna go ahead and try it. Uh, I'm using a t-shirt today that is not very important to me. It's kind of stretched out on the sides and it kind of shrank up a little bit, so my dark wing duck t-shirt, if it gets oil stains, not a big deal. So, uh, let's just go ahead and basically jump right into this. Uh, there's no soaking to be done because there's no brush. Uh, there's no lathering to be done because there's no brush or cream. So we're just gonna go ahead and jump right into this. So let's go ahead and start the hot water running. I did just get out of the shower. So we're gonna go ahead and just let that heat up a bit and we're gonna hydrate the face a little bit more. And then we'll go ahead and lather uh, canola oil on my face. And then we will see what we will see. All right. Hi. I'd also like to wish a belated happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there. I did wish a Father's Day, Happy Father's Day Friday, and I just wanted to do it again. Hope you all had a great day, if you did anything. Um, for those of you who Father's Day is a, di is a difficult day, as it is for me and many others out there, uh, I'm wishing you all the best. I hope you went through it without any issues. 
Hope it didn't cause too much depression or anxiety. So for those of you who was a hard time, I'm with you. For the rest of you, I hope you had a fantastic time hanging out with your kids or your parents or what have you. Uh, the world has opened up a little bit more than it was last year, so more and more people got to spend time with their families, and that's definitely, definitely a plus. So for those of you that did that, hope you had fun. Give me some comments below. Let me know what y'all did. Uh, let's go ahead and just start with some oil. That is a lot, more than is necessary. But we'll go ahead and rub it right on my hands. Rub it right on my face. You can hear it. I don't know if you can see. You can see the slickness. You can definitely see that. You don't know how well, other than the slickness, you can see it. But it's definitely on there. It doesn't. There's not much of a smell, so it's already, in my opinion, got to step up from the uh, coconut oil. Right off the bat, I can tell you it would definitely make a great pre-shave. Now the question is, does it work as shaving cream by itself? You know what I'm finding interesting right off the bat? It's definitely taken the hair off, but you can see the line of hair. It's not sticking to the razor. It sort of greased up the razor, so the hair is basically sticking to my face in a line at the bottom, which is interesting. I am not going to lie, right off the bat, it's working quite well. Be careful not to push down on the razor because there is more of a chance of irritation. But it is working quite well. The slickness is doing better than you would think. Not as great as other things. And I honestly, I don't know. I'll tell you one thing, I thought I grab I thought it felt it grabbed the skin but the, the oil kind of released the skin from where it was grabbing, so it didn't. That's a step in the right direction. I'd say it more likely works better as as a pre-shave, but it does work. First pass alone actually went very, very well. So we're gonna rinse off, we're gonna apply for uh, pass two. Looks like I did get myself slightly right on that damn scar. Scar from my biopsy, as I've mentioned before. But that happens. But it's not bad, it's more just irritation. Maybe I didn't get enough oil in that spot. That's extremely possible. Right. Less oil this time. 
like I said, pre-shave. Works better as a pre-shave, but it does work. In a pinch, it's better than dry shaving to be sure. So if you are without shaving cream, but you have canola oil in the house, it would work. Definitely works. Surprisingly well, if I'm being honest. I mean, it's not something I'd recommend. It works better than peanut butter, which peanut butter actually works pretty well. Um, peanut butter just clogs the hell out of your razor. One more pass. It's not the best of shaves. I definitely think I would have preferred it with a cream on top of it. So preferred using this as a uh, pre-shave to an actual shaving cream, but then it wouldn't be a shaving with video, would it? No, it would be a pre-shave video, which I'll start doing those as well. Basically, what, I'm, what I might do is anything that I've come across that might work better as a pre-shave, such as the oils, I may do a pre-shave video with. So that's an idea. If that's something you'd be interested in seeing, like this, the canola, the coconut oil, and anything else that I've done a shaving with video on that you think might work better as a pre-shave, if, you, if you'd like to see me do a video of using this and those other products as pre-shaves, let me know. Put in the comments below. Let me know if that'd be something you'd be interested in seeing. Definitely be something I'd be interested in doing. All right. I'm glad I did this today. This was a fun one. I needed a fun after yesterday. Yesterday, Father's Day is a rough day for me. Um, I don't have kids and... I want kids and I don't have my dad or my grandparents for that matter. So Father's Day is always very difficult, especially since it always falls either right before or right after my dad's birthday. It's, it's a hard day. There we go. Just even up the sideburns a bit. Okay. Not bad, but yeah, this was a fun video. Glad I did this. 
I need it after yesterday. How are you guys holding up? I know I mentioned earlier if you, if it's a hard day for you guys, um, but let, let me know how you're holding up if it is in fact a hard day. Put in the comments below. Let's let's talk about this. There's nothing wrong with feeling depressed around Father's Day. Nothing wrong with that at all. Nothing wrong with feeling depressed, period. So definitely go ahead and let's go ahead and see if we can end that a bit. All right. Not too shabby. Again, it would work better as a pre-shave. I don't know that shaving with... One second. I don't know that shaving with canola oil is something that I'm necessarily going to be jumping at to do again. But it did the job. It definitely did the job, so that's good. So can you shave with canola oil? Yes. Maybe that will stop the world from ending. But we did answer the question. We answered the question to end all questions. We did it, guys. Can you shave with canola oil? Yes, you can. You can. And we did. We did. All right, I'm done. Uh, let's go ahead and splash on some uh, alcohol. Just some rubbing alcohol. Ho, 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 that burns. Oh, motherfucker. Sorry, sorry, but ow, mother. Mm. Oh, that burned. That was worse than any aftershave. Ha. Huh. I would say there was probably irritation on there because that burned. Oh, mother, mother of pearl. All right. So hope you got a kick out of that part. Whoa. Wow. All right. Anyway, as my face, the fire slowly starts to die down on my face. Let's go ahead and, and jump out of this video, shall we? Uh, if you're watching this video and you have not yet, please, please hit that subscribe button. Click that bell icon for notifications. And if you feel up to it, hit me up on Patreon. Give me some support and love there. But I thank you all for watching regardless. If you like this video, you like all my videos, hit that like button. Give me a comment below. That said, of course, as always, stay happy, stay healthy, and keep shaving. I'll see you on the next video.